Well, good morning, everyone, and welcome to the Kingdom Faith for Doors channel. My name is Miguel Fuentes, and good morning and happy Friday. Hope you guys are doing good today. And so today's uh, Kingdom Talk, we're going to be talking about what is a shofar. And uh, we're going to be taking a look at uh, Numbers chapter 10, verse 9. It says, when you go to war in your land against the enemy who opposes you, then you shall sound an alarm with the trumpets. And you will be remembered before the Lord your God, and you will be saved from your enemies. So what is a shofar, and what is a uh, significance of the shofar? Uh, the shofar is, when I'm doing my research, uh, a shofar is an instrument of spiritual warfare. Uh, it's made with a ram's horn, and you can look up, or what a shofar looks like. Uh, it's used for, you know, to sound the alarm. It's used to, you know, sim, you know, to assemble the people of God, to announce the new moon, uh, the jubilee year, um, and, and so, and so I think I think this is part of a. Um, I would say. One one of the most interesting instruments that God has been using throughout hundred, uh, thousands of years, and the shofar has been now been used uh, quite often, and um, and it, you know the, the the sound of the shofar is is very very loud, and and it just uh, it just brings music to God's ears basically and um, as, as, as the book of Numbers until uh, we see the word trumpets which is a shofar that they use and so they, they sound the alarm and God will remember when you sorry you'll be, be remembered before the Lord your God that God is with you always until the end of uh, the uh, of the world, and um, it is it's a blessing to hear the shofar being being blown, and and in some sort of you know it creates a a vibration and a frequency that is out of this world, you know, and uh, the sh the shofar blast is a sign to God that the day of the Lord is near. Um, I think this is going to be my last point. You know, I know it's going to be kind of short. Uh, but the shofar is a pretty, pretty, uh, uh, it's a pretty powerful one. Uh, let me see here. And so the shofar is not only to call to war, but also as a proclamation of freedom. Um, basically, basically, this is like a uh, a wake up call, uh, stirring the Jews to mend their ways and repent. Sleepers waking up from their slumber, you know, all these things, uh, you know, blowing the shofar. Uh, sound the the Sabbath, announce the new moon. Um, the pop uh, proclaim the anointing of a new king. Um, and uh, and also whenever we hear the Safar, we we remind us to re. Dedicate our, ourselves to the Word of God and to remind God of our um, original commission and in, in, in security. Um, but there are uh, a lot of powerful, powerful revelations when we study the shofar and, and how it used and, and all that so I mean it's, it's been it's been it's been a, a a amazing uh study you know that that I've been doing and um 
Yeah, so the Tafar is there's a instrument that God uses for his people. And um yeah, so that's all I got for today folks. I hope you enjoyed this uh short video. I uh, hope that this is a blessing to you and yeah, so may God bless you, may God keep you. See you guys again next time. Bye.